Hey guys, and welcome to my Let's Play The Sims 3 Generations and Seasons. Um, so I decided to do Generations and Seasons because they go really well together, I think. You know, Generations, that's all it is, is family, family, family. Um, you know, kids can do so much more, teenagers can get into trouble, parents can punish them, so on, so on. Uh, and then with Seasons, I feel like the, you know, seasons, like the festivals and stuff they have, are very family friendly so I think that they go really well together so instead of just doing generations let's play or seasons let's play I decided to combine them so we will dive into both the generations gameplay and the seasons gameplay um, so I'm gonna go into create a sim now and I'll quickly introduce myself uh, my name is Whitney um, I go by starlight sims on both here and Twitter I've been making let's plays since January so not very long uh -huh. uh, so i'm still very much a rookie at all of this um i have another let's play on here that is uh the sims 2 legacy challenge and i will continue to do that as well as this i just got a new computer um i haven't been able to play the sims 3 how you really should be able to play it because i had an old computer and everybody knows how the sims 3 runs on old crappy computers it doesn't so <laughs> i just got this new computer you know however many years, five years after the Sims series released, so I'm just now getting being able to actually play the game for what it's worth. So I decided to do these Let's Plays. Um, it might run a little choppy, my game, because I have uh, fraps running in the background, but it's fine. It's cool. It's good. It's fine. <laughs> um, so I'm going to go into Create a Sim, and since I take forever to create Sims, I will just um, edit edit everything you know once once I'm done and like I'll edit the video so everything's fast fa fast paced so you don't have to sit through me dragging the slider and all of that because I'm very picky about how they look and stuff so so I'll do that and you'll see it on the screen and then I'll get back with you guys
Um, she's really cute, young, pretty. Um, yeah, I didn't change her hair color at all, actually, from the original person that popped up. I didn't change the hair color because I actually really, really liked it. Um, so pretty much everything on her is custom content. Um, so yeah, she is artistic, dramatic, excitable. I think I might actually change that one to, hmm, I do want to make her neat, I think, so they can keep the house nice and neat. And <clears throat> yeah, that's good. So she is artistic, dramatic. Uh, I just wanted to add something a little fun in there, you know. Um, and she loves the cold, which came with seasons. And I just made her neat. And nurturing, which came with uh, generations. So yeah, her uh, lifetime want is to be surrounded by family. Which is to raise five children from babies to teenagers. I don't know if I'll actually have them have five kids. <laughs> um... But at least it's something that, you know, they're obviously going to have kids. So, you know, I figured why not. Uh, her favorites are, favorite food is Goopy Carbonara. Uh, favorite music is kids. And her favorite color is red. And she is an Aquarius. So and now we'll go over to her future gone. hunk. Her future hubby hubby. I actually think he's really cute, but maybe that's just me. Um, his name is Matthew Logan. So she will eventually be Caitlin Logan. Um, I'm just starting them out as acquaintances right now. Not even boyfriend-girlfriend, because I really want to take you guys through the dating and stuff that came with Generations, I believe. So they'll date before they get married and stuff. So they're not even boyfriend-girlfriend yet. They're just um, acquaintances. They're going to be roommates, I guess you could say. So, uh, yeah, he's pretty chill. I couldn't decide on his hair color. I don't know if you could notice or not in the video, but he, I could not choose a hair color. I was like back and forth, back and forth. But I guess I settled on this. It's a little bit lighter than hers. I didn't want them there to have the exact same hair color. Um, so he's a pretty casual dude. You know, he's kind of a man's man, I guess you could say. Um, he is family oriented, handy. Uh, he loves the heat, which came with seasons. Loves the outdoors. And he's also a natural cook. So he's going to be... Um, in the culinary career, so I figured he would have the celebrated five-star chef wish, which is to reach level 10 of the culinary career. So um, I just got the bakery stuff from the Sims 3 store, so I might be um, incorporating that into my game at some point. You know, maybe he wants to be a baker or something. He has a dream of owning a bakery or something, you know, so we'll see about that. Um, so his favorites are sushi, indie music, and seafoam. I didn't change any of that. Uh, and he is a Cancer. So yeah, these are the Sims and they don't really have like a specific storyline right now. They're just well, kind of these acquaintances that were just thrown into this house together. And <laughs> and uh, we'll eventually be having a family and falling in love and all of that really cute stuff. So yeah, these are the Sims and um, I can't wait for all of us to get to know them a little bit better. Um, I think of my Sims as actual people because I'm crazy, but um, I really, I'm, I'm really looking forward to diving into this Let's Play. So let's go ahead and accept them. Badibuza? And I don't think I even have to edit their relationships much because I, I think they're just acquaintances, housemates. So yeah, they're just housemates right now. They have no idea what they're in for. <laughs> so yeah, I meant to save it as the Logan family. So it would have his last name, but I just saved it as the Thomas family, which is her last name. But what can you do? So I actually, um, I am not going to use any uh, money cheats in this game. Because it takes the fun out of it for me whenever they have a ton of money. Because then I don't know what to do with myself. Because they don't really need to work. And there's really, it just takes away a lot of the fun out of it for me, anyway. Um, so... I did go into Riverview. This is Sunset Valley, as you can see. But I went into Riverview, which is a town that you can download for free at the Sims 3 store. And I 
got one of the cheap houses from there and put it into this game, into Sunset Valley, because I've already played all of these, you know, all of these other houses that came in Sunset Valley that are super cheap, and I think everybody's already done them. So I wanted to do something, I want them to have a different look, looking house, you know. So here is the house. Um, they will get it furnished, actually. Um, the house, as all starter houses are in this game, is crap. But there's, you know, a little bit of land on it, so I could expand on it, and I will make it prettier over time. I promise, I promise it will not look like this much like crap throughout the entire Let's Play, I swear. Um, <laughs> I've never seen this before. Oh no, the house you've purchased was struck by a small meteor and seems to have sustained some minor fire damage. Would you like to accept the challenge of cleaning up after the meteor? Um, sure. I've never done this, but I'll do it. I guess. I don't know. Um, <laughs> I've never done this. I've never seen that. What, what's the point of it? Like what, what does it do? Oh my God. Oh, well, she's clean. So she can, she's gonna, she can clean the house. She's neat. She's neat. Awesome. Okay. I'm glad that came in handy. So he's going to be in the culinary career. She is going to be in the daycare profession because that's what came with generations. So she's going to clean up <laughs> and um, he will, huh, you can go get that job actually. Let's go have him get the job before we do anything else because this is the Sims and they need jobs. So we'll have him work at this bistro place. Join the culinary career. And we'll go back over to her. What is that music for? Oh, I miss him. Oh. Does anybody know what this is? Okay. Did it stop? That is so strange. Hold on a minute. I'm going to go see something. I had the music turned off, so I don't know why music was playing. Um, but, um, that's strange. So he, Matthew, got a new job. He got the job at the bistro. Oh, this bitch right here is trying to hit on him. Excuse me, missy. But we are very much so taken. And Caitlin is, well, actually, no, he's not taken. That's a lie. But Caitlin is much, much prettier than her. What is up with my game here? That is so strange. Oh, okay, there we go. That is weird that it's taken a while loading. I think I'm actually going to restart my game here. So sometimes that helps it run a little quicker for me. So, yeah, he's just getting his job. Listen to, is this the one that was hitting on him more gun? Nice Aren't you taken? I don't want to talk to you. So, I'm going to go home. Thank you. Um, so I will restart my game right now. And um, I'll get back to you guys. Hey guys, so I restarted my game. Um, I have everything on the highest settings possible in this game. <laughs> So if it starts running a little slow, it's, I might have to change that. Um, but I'll show you guys the house cause I totally didn't do that. So this is obviously it's the front, <laughs> the front door. It's a little crispy right now, but hopefully that will, oh, we have to replace it with money. Oh, I should have totally ignored that little challenge. Anyway. Um, so you walk in, this is like a little dining area. I really like the window. And, um, yeah, your basic living room. And I actually like the kitchen. Like, I know the brown appliances are disgusting, but, um, I actually really like the brick wall. I like that. I don't know, it gives, like, this, like, rustic type thing. I don't know. I like it. 
and it actually it comes with two bedrooms so like this could be their room and then this could be their first child's room and then there's this whole thing out here and it's like a little cooking area or something and I could totally like delete that you know and add a bunch of space over here I did um, create a house for these people specifically so um, but it's like 200 something thousand dollars um, <laughs> so they won't be able to move into that for quite a while I might have to use one of these lifetime rewards like I think there's a lifetime reward for like oh I don't know it's like inheritance or something like that let me see there's one that's like inheritance and I thought there's another one too maybe not oh there's a genie lamp too so we might have to use that to get them some money at some point but for now this is their house and uh, yeah so it's cute I think it's little I mean it is what it is it's the Sims you know um I don't believe I, I hate the bathroom it's like this puke yellow green color and it's really disgusting I will change that at some point <laughs> um, but for now you know they don't need a whole heck of a lot of stuff so um yeah so he's on his way home and oh here comes the university mascot we're not going to university this is not a university let's play go home go home Wayne you go you wow you go look at him look at his little strut I love this strut <laughs> I don't understand it at all but I mean of course it's a llama mascot of course the Sims is like obsessed with llamas. We're not going to university. We will maybe have a university let's play sometime in the future, but not right now. So she's trying to clean the house and he is totally getting in her way. No, you don't clean. She cleans. Okay? She cleans. <laughs> yeah, learn the cooking skill, why don't you? They don't have Oh yeah, they do. They have a bookshelf. Um here you go. They have two cooking books, but they're the same exact thing. Ooh, okay, we can actually sell this for $20. Yes, we can. $20, woohoo. Um, she's taking forever to clean this place. Holy crap, I should not have accepted this challenge at all. And why are you laying down to read it? You have a couch. It's an ugly couch, but it's still a couch. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna have fun with him. I can tell already. So, <laughs> um, so yeah, I probably gonna end this part here. Um, in the next part, I plan on what are you bitching about? She can't get around the bed to clean what this? Okay, stop. Go over here. It's rocket science. Obviously, it's rocket science. Okay, we'll move the bed. How about that? We'll move the bed out into the yard. You guys can sleep under the stars tonight, okay? Okay. <laughs> so, yeah. In the next part, I'm going to probably focus on their... Um... Oh my gosh, she's still not happy. <sighs> she is a drama queen. Okay. In the next part... <laughs> in the next part, they will uh, probably go on their first date. So... I really want to get started with this whole baby stuff, baby making stuff. So, um, so yeah, if you guys like this video, go ahead and what are you doing? Who is this? And what? Hey, welcome to the neighborhood. I just stopped by to, oh my, what happened here? You weren't playing with fire, were you? Hey, you want me to help clean up? Hold on, my timer is going off because it knows that I need to be done by now. Yes, please help me clean. Wow. You are a very nice fireman. What is your name? Adam Andre Andreessen? Well, thanks, dude. That is awesome. Wow. You are a stand-up dude. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. If you like this video, go ahead, like it, um, subscribe, comment, you know, uh, follow me on Twitter. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.